The save page for Kanye and Ty Dolla Sign's new album, Vultures, is now down off stream. Who cares about that? Let's talk about how Kanye is still on this Nazi shit. So as some of you guys have probably seen, uh, he's been placing this very particular double-headed bird crest in numerous visuals uh, around the promotion of the record. And it is very much giving German nationalism vibes. There is also, of course, the album art, which is very clearly ripping off the album art of Burzum a Scandinavian black metal artist who has uh, very publicly voiced white supremacist views. Meanwhile, the landscape itself depicted here on the album cover was done by a German artist who at one point was very much favored uh, by the Nazis, which you can read right here below. And let's be clear, he had nothing to do with them personally. Uh, he died long before they were in power. So Kanye is very much doing this weird white supremacist breadcrumbing once again. Two things. One, don't allow his annoying ass fan base or really cult, because that's what his fan base is at this point, a cult. Don't allow them to gaslight you into thinking that it's not happening and it's not real and it doesn't exist. It is real. And two, why is Kanye doing this? And it's got to be for one of two reasons. One, Kanye not too long ago went on that whole, you know, white supremacist jaunt where he was palling around with white supremacists and endorsing Hitler. And now he just wants to work racist symbolism into his art as a means of maybe disarming any criticisms that people might still have around it, which honestly only an idiot would fall for and is a coward's way of kind of stepping around the necessity to apologize for and fess up to the things that you said and things that you did. And the other possible option is that he actually believes in this stuff and thinks it's true. Either way, it's not good.